Ladies, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, we are back, another episode, and Tanisha here, I don't know what she thinks is going on, but this, oh hell no. What, this? What? <laughs> Yo, hold on. Yo. Bro, put that down. Yeah, please. Put Bro, that down. I'll put that down. Let me, let me have this, thank you. Jeez. Okay, guys. We got some good food coming right up. <laughs> we are back. Yes. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I have the, I'm hungry. the infinity, the omega, the alpha, the the criteria of all criterias. Mm. I just be making up shit. What the yeah, hell? I have the I'm ultimate good. black queen beside of me. Chef T back with another amazing episode of Stuntman's Kitchen. You know, what, I don't even know what is the name of this thing because I keep on calling it different names. Cooking with Safari. Oh, Cooking with Safari. Cooking with the Stunt Boss. Cooking with the Stunt Boss. Yeah. All right, um, so you ready? Yes, I'm ready. First and first, first foremost, um, Um, I just, why? Why, why, why? That's... I'm gonna get my apron. Please. Mm -hmm. Wow, you know the jewelry, already, man. Yeah, I, I told, I told um, Tanisha I would never put on this robe without her. Is this a robe? This apron. Whatever you call it, you know what the hell it is. I'm excited. I'm very excited. Today, we are making a salmon salad. It's very easy. Salmon salad. We're going to keep it simple. Super easy. So we have some fresh uh, salmon here. Mm-hmm. Well mm. caught. Mm. Some why, why you ain't picked that up? Olive oil seasoning. I'm getting there. I'm saying the best for last. Oh, OK. Some olive oil. <laughs> Seasoning. Olive oil so seasoning. I, yeah, so I just put some olive oil in uh, this bowl here, along with some dry herbs. So we're gonna rub that. That's your job today. You're gonna season the salmon. Do you drink? If I drink? Mm hmm Not really. Socially. Mm. I feel like it. Okay. Why? You drink? Same. You're just, thirsty? No, I'm just saying. I'm just wondering. Because you're a Jamaican woman, and most Jamaican women I know drink alcohol. Ah, yeah, socially. Mm. So we have some cherry tomatoes here, some feta cheese, some chopped red onion, corn, cilantro, and I love avocado, so I'm gonna add avocado to this salad. And then I'm gonna save the best for last, so we have some cucumbers here. Oh, why you have to jerk them like that? <laughs> what the? Add some pepper and salt that we're gonna put right on um, to finish off the salad. Easy. Listen, so Tanisha took um, some busy time out of her busy schedule or is it time out of her busy schedule? Mm -hmm. Is that how you say it? Whatever the hell the damn saying is. Yeah, she's and, a busy um, woman. She's a busy woman. Mm -hmm. Her birthday is tomorrow. And, um, the day after. Same thing. Yeah. And um, I just wanted to say happy birthday. Woo, I got some champagne. Let's Woo! start it off early. Yes. Save that. I don't know if you want to open we it. You open can. open it right now. You want to open it, but it's not cold. Okay, so let's chill it. So we'll have the salad with some champagne. Yeah, honestly. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome, you're welcome. Ah, you wasn't expecting that, huh? No, I'm putting it in the freezer. Yeah, yeah, that's how y'all need to do it. Why you, you over here jerking these damn cucumbers? <laughs> I'm here surprising you with some champagne, you know? Period, that was very thoughtful. Of you. Yeah, thank you know, thank you. We appreciate you. And look, all my subscribers, everyone who's here at the YouTube world, they love these videos, so. They do? Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, I tried to do one with this other chef. This other girl, she came by and um... Was I miss? Sort of kind. So you cheated on me with another chef? It was horrible. It was so bad. And she knows who she is. So you're, I'm not, not, post even, you're not posting? That's, it's not even coming out. <laughs> it's not seeing the light of day. Anyway, she sucks and we're back with the queen. Let's get to it. All right, so your job right now is to season the salmon. Oh my. You don't wanna get your nails dirty? What do I... How, I, how, how do I season this? Super easy. All right, let me give you a spoon since you're being a crybaby. Put it up here. 
Yeah. So you're just gonna drip it? Ooh. Come on. But uh, now you, you have to like... You nasty little girl, you. Come on, season. I'm no, hold excited. on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You keep on trying to act like you the one doing everything here. And it's all me. <laughs> oh, get that sauce in there, you nasty little shrub and sauce, you. Oh, yeah. So since he's always complaining that I'm doing fattening food. Hold on, what if I do it like this? I mean, it does taste better when you put your hand in it. You know? Yeah. Then you can feel the love in the food. Nah, ain't no love, my G. You have to cook with love. No, I cook with love, but. So you have to massage the food. You have to feel it up. I mean, I feel up no fish. <laughs> Boss up. <laughs> mm-hmm. No. Oh. And today, we have two other humans that. Um, He's in the building. Yeah, they're in the building, and they may potentially be trying the food. Are you guys hungry? Maybe you should go into the kitchen and get yourself something to eat then, huh? Honestly, usually when we cook, I'm starving and I act like a maniac. But today, I'm not gonna do that because- Today I, you're not hungry? Yeah, today I ate a little bit and I said, let me make so sure- So you're exercising self-control today? Yes, today I'm gonna have self-control. You belly, know, belly control. Usually I'm impatient, but before this, I put something inside of me. I'm gonna be way more level-headed. Did you do <laughs> this season? Yeah, that Did ain't season. Did you do it on both sides? Both sides? <laughs> oh my gosh. Hold on, let me see if I got some gloves. Gloves. Damn. Safari. Huh? Could I, could I use, could I use these gloves to rub the seasoning? No. <laughs> I don't want that on my hand. No, you cannot use that gloves. See, he's, he's not a real chef. Anyway, so I'm basically just chopping up the cucumbers. You can remove the seeds if you want, but I love the seeds, so I'm gonna let boss it. Boss up. Hey, let me explain to y'all. <laughs> Whenever you hear me say boss up, that means that you said something. That's suspect. That's, it's suspect, and it could be deemed as a sexual innuendo. Okay. Boss up. Look. It's like pause. Anyways, but you guys know what I mean. You know what? You want me See, to do you it? can remove the seed if you want. Yeah, I like the seeds. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I wouldn't You want me to do the salmon and you finish it? Yeah. Anything that has to do with man, me not touch it. <laughs> if this was called sal gyal, then I would do it. But salmon, no. <laughs> Sa gyal. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? So, I think we only need to use one cucumber. Yeah, one. one a, this one is so thick, yeah. long, hard, and girthy. We do not need more than one of these. <laughs> Ladies, is this enough? Is this enough? Is this enough? Hold on. TT, is this enough? Cut it in half. No, that's not what I meant. Cut the cameras. I wouldn't know. I'm a Christian woman. Oh, yeah, me too. <laughs> yep. I'm a Christian. Well, you cut it. What? Look how I have them here. What, they too thick? Yeah, so now this needs to be cut in four. Hold it's on. It's too thick. Mm -hmm. Now that's too thin. Boy, you make your life really hard, though. Listen, I'm the one who taught you. Boy, if you don't get... Okay, watch out, watch out, watch your style, man. Boom. In four. Damn, this one's thick. You need to do it in four. What you mean, like this? Yes. Mmm. Later that night. Wow, we making a salad. This is so hard. Listen, a lot of y'all need to eat more of y'all greens. Okay, now what? <clears throat> look at that. Mine's look better than yours. So pretty. Yeah, mine's look way better. All right, so now you're gonna cut the tomato in half. They're a little bit big, so I'm gonna do... Can you do this? Of course I could do that. All right. Take me for full. That's so crazy. We have like a big award-winning director here, and we're here doing everything by ourselves. <laughs> you guys is lazy, yo. No invite? Safari, why would you do that? You know what? It, there be certain people who have skills, and then they just hate their skills. And it's like, 
They don't like to do it. It's like it's a job. But, mm. but they don't realize they're doing what they love and they take it for granted. Damn, this is dangerous. I am scared. I hate using knives. Sidebar. I have been stabbed before. Oh, for real? Yep. What did you do to her? You know what I can't stand about certain stuff when things happen and people say, but what did he do? What did she do? Okay. So if I was to, um, if the roles were reversed and I did it to a woman, no one's going to say, what did she do? True. You have a point. <clears throat> yeah, a big point. Okay, now what? Point. All right, so this is how we're looking. Mm. Very pretty, very clean. Do you know what this is? Um, purple onions. Okay, great job. Ja ja man. Great job. What's you up with you? Let me do this. You try to hog everything. I'm gonna get you. A <laughs> Oh, yeah, get these onions in there right now. Oh, you fill it up, you dirty onions, you. Oh! This is very dangerous. Yes. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yo. I wish I knew how to cook like this. Awesome. Now... You know what this is? This is corn. Yay! Corn. All right, so... Duh! Oh, you don't you. have to use all of it. Get in there, you filthy corny. Oh, you're so corny. They love saying I'm corny. Oh, yeah, get it in there, you corny. <laughs> a little bit of extra corn for the people who think yeah, you're corny. Yeah, you're so corny, you <laughs> filthy little corn. No, ma'am. Um, oh, gosh. Okay, all right, what's so next? the best part is the cilantro. Ooh. You smell how this smells good? Yeah, I smell it. Mm, damn. Oh, I ain't gonna lie, this is looking kind of fire. Okay, what's up with this? That's a little salt and pepper. When we this will, go? We will not end the salad, but I'll do it because we're not gonna be using all of it. Oh, so you don't think I'm smart enough? I don't trust you with this. Okay? Mm. Okay, now this is the hardest part of making a salad, guys. The mix-up. I'm always in mix-up, so... Why not mix it up? Oh, uh, yeah, you get it in there, you filthy corn, you. Wow. I need more greens. Oh, it's perfect. So today I'm gonna be cooking for two individuals who I know. This is looking pretty. Eat your greens, people. Yes. Eat your greens. So the salad is done, the salmon is done. Yes, yes, finally. What a, <laughs> what a mission. Ooh, it was not a mission. What a journey. This was very hard. Safari so made it. Mm-hmm. Salmon. So. Yeah, because you know what? It's late, we don't want to eat too heavy. Chef T's birthday is coming up, so we're trying to keep everything period clean. You know what I'm saying? Yes. So okay. So are you gonna at least share the food? Should I do it? Yes. You know I don't know how to do stuff like this. I got it. So since we have guests, right? Guests, guests that need to be eaten out of. You know what? Don't, don't do it. Oh, now the guests wanna be talking, huh? Don't do it, bro. <laughs> This is what I want to know, YouTube family. When people come to your house, is it rude to say, here's some paper plates because I know you ain't about to wash no dishes? Or you want to use my nice glass porcelain plates, fill up my sink, use up my sponges, and my dishwashing detergent? Because what? Oh, run up and find your mama. What the hell? All right, guys, oh. we're about to try this out. Listen, guys, I'm gonna be quite honest with you. I'm really not that hungry, and I'm pretty sure you could tell in this video I had a lot more patience. I wasn't acting like a wild Neanderthal. 
And um, let's see, especially for some fish. I'm just not a fishy guy. Flavorful. Mm hmm. Seasoned. Mm. You know where I just came from? Where? Twin Peaks. Oh. I had a chicken wrap. You're not allowed to eat before we do. Okay, before, you never said that. Before you used to be telling me have patience. And this was the way for me to have patience. Because you know, usually I act like a crazy mongrel dog. True. Sure. You know how greedy he is? By himself, he wears a bird and a rat and fries. By himself. Just now? Yeah. Mm -mm. Did you watch the WNBA finals? Who, me? No. It's the women's basketball. You're supposed to be supporting women. Isn't that what y'all do? Support each other no matter what? Ride for each other? Yeah. Yeah. True, but I just didn't watch it. You didn't even know it happened. True. You know what teams played? No idea. Mm. Is it one of them that Angel Reese is on? <laughs> no, you know about Angel Reese. Mm. So, you know what I think we should do? What? I'm gonna pick one lucky subscriber mm -hmm. to do an episode of Safari's Kitchen mm. with me and Chef T. Okay. We're gonna give you an option of dishes and we're gonna let you be a guest in our kitchen. Um, we're gonna have to sign a bunch of paperwork. We have to do a bunch of psychology checkups. <laughs> background checks. Background check. STD check. There will be a lot of security. <laughs> Um, around the premises, but it's gonna be good. J listen, just- Should there be someone who is like a chef or- Mmm. So like give them an opportunity to put themselves out there? I should, think we do a, should we do a chef or like just a fan okay. who loves to watch? Okay. Cause I know you don't like too much people in the kitchen. No. But I'm down for that. I think that would be fire. Mm. So, we are going to be doing a cooking with Safari and Chef T special edition episode mm -hmm. with one lucky subscriber. Um, they have to live in Florida? I, yes. That will make it easier. One day we're going to get to the point where we're flying them out, putting mm -hmm. them up. I like that. This is how we get back. This ain't no mukbang. I cooked it from scratch. You saw that. Mm -hmm. You saw Chef T assist me. Mm -hmm. And that's usually what happens. I'm the lead chef. Mm -hmm. I'm the executive chef. He is. And Chef T usually just, she does stuff pass like- Passing the salt. Yeah, like pass me the pot, turn on the stove, warm up a pot for me, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And I just want to say I'm grateful to have an assistant like you. You're welcome. Um, and you know what? I have a surprise for you. You do? Since it's your birthday, mm -hmm. I'm gonna wash the dishes. Really? Yeah. Not the dishwasher? No, I'm gonna wash the dishes today. And I brought you some real um, dish soap. So my dish soap is fake? It was too gentle. You know what? When you're a man who lives by yourself, sometimes that's why it's good when a man can live with a woman because when you live with a woman, you just get those extra levels of things that a man don't think about. Mm. I go to the store, I mean, I'm like, blood clot, done. Done, done, done. Because I seen the commercial where the little duck had the oil. Mm. Remember the duck was covered in oil and then they used the Dawn soap? And I'm like, damn, if that blue soap could wash that duck that was just covered in car engine oil, why can't it wash my dishes? But you did not have Dawn, though. Stop the cap. <laughs> What I have? You had some other stuff that didn't work. Palm olive. This is what I want to know. How did that duck get all that car engine oil all over it? That's kind of crazy. It's like all of these people and these activists, they pick and choose what they want to stand up for. Stand up for those ducks in those Dawn commercials. 
They taking these little yellow ducks, they covering them up in black oil to show that their dishwashing soap works? We need a change. We need a change, y'all. Protect these ducks. I'm out. Protect these nuts, too. You still <laughs> Protect the ducks, please. Trick!